Greetings and salutations, folks. My name is Nick, and welcome back to Final Doom, the Plutonia Experiment. Where we are apparently given an impossible mission. Which I feel is a bit of a... A bit of a dubious moniker, because a lot of these missions have been fairly... impossible. Like, trying to elevate this one as being difficult... ...feels like it's a little bit of... ...too little, too late sort of thing. I've already been thrown into giant hallways. Oh, okay. Let's not just stand there and wait for rockets to come at us. Um, can I shoot through that? At a distance, yes. Does this open up? I need a red key to open up that door. It's interesting how inconsistent the DLC is in regards to labeling doors visually. I'm not saying that's a bad thing, I'm just saying that it's interesting. Like, each uh, designer has their own priorities as to what they leave in, and I wonder exactly how much time um, was given to the, to the people who made these levels. Oh, hello. Actually, let's just shoot one rocket. And then there's a yellow key over there. Oh, one of you is a lot. I suppose not for long. Because, like, there are a lot of interesting things in regards to the uh, level designs in uh, this particular section of the game. Um, but I also noticed that, like, there are certain instances where, like, doors are not necessarily labeled. It uses inconsistent uh, sides to doors that you would not expect. Um, the way portals for enemies are just kind of out there in the open, so you know that they're just going to show up there. Um, does kind of give me the impression like there's only so much time to make the level, especially since the levels themselves are relatively short, which I'm not complaining about. Um, I, th I think the shorter levels benefit the experience. Oh, a dead end. And I could go that way as well, alright. Oh, hello. Who gave you a window view? And where does that door go? Oh, I can just walk through. I can just walk through. That makes things very simple. Why, hello. And yes, I noticed there's a switch over there, but I'm just going to go a little bit past just to see if there's anything there that probably opens up with the switch. If I had a guess. The answer is yes. Oh, hello. So I've got a yellow key and a red key. Also, that's kind of one of the previous levels actually had a red key marked by what is usually used as kind of like a marking for locks. That, that's the kind of thing I mean. Just interesting reuse of original assets. Um, that's back, so let's go down. Oh. Can I 
shoot some rockets at you. Maybe one of those rockets hit. Oh, hello. Oh, was that enough? Huh. How are we going to do this? Everybody's kind of tucked away in their corner. Okay, I think this was actually the wise choice. Oh. <laughs> Are you kind of stuck in your little spot? rockets like how did that rocket go way over there oh because uh it had switched targeting to this uh to this guy i think yes i was gonna say i think i that hit uh that arachnatron. All right, and that restored the, um, hello. That restored the bridge. What does that switch do? Maybe I will never, oh, hello. Let's try another shot. There we go. So now I have... The yellow key. Oh, okay. That's what that switch does. Interesting that I can't use the yellow key to open that, but then there was that yellow door way over to the right, so let us... Invisible walls. Great. Um, I'm sure I left some health randomly throughout this level to pick myself back up again. Alright, so in order to get back Additional enemies. Oh my, there's a whole bunch of people now guarding the red key. Including an art file. And a whole bunch of BFG shots wasn't enough. Yeah, too much splash damage at that distance. I'd like to actually just hit the 
arc vial. That's possible. Did I leave any health that I could fall back on? The answer is yes. This is not good, but it is not terrible. Nope. All right, let's not approach this window. I don't, I didn't remember that plasma had splash damage associated with it. Okay. It's good to know that this green goo is somehow not toxic. Ah, oh, a blue key. What could be a trap? The slime, maybe? All right. It wasn't the slime, it was just a hidden elevator. And I haven't even had to go through that yellow door yet. So let's actually take care of that right now. Because that probably just has me push a switch if I... Okay. That was not expected. I guess let's go through the uh, blue door. Why, oh, hello! other others of you around here? The answer is no. Oh, hello. Oh, yep. That was not a bad escape, if I say so myself. I always misjudge the amount of rockets it takes to defeat a mancubus. There we go. Now that one's gone. Are you still there? You who are lingering in this hallway. And what did this switch do? Oh, yeah, that was closed off, I think. Ah, sneaky. Having dark, slimy backgrounds. Alright, if I had to guess... 
what it does is it opens up the lock on the door that is this way. Wasn't there still a shotgun box? Yes. There we go. And now I can go through here. Pick that up. Pick that up. And then... Hi, hello! And actually, now that I know that the floor is non-toxic, I suppose I might as well pick up these rockets. Is this floor toxic? It is not. Hmm. Oh, hold on. There was a switch. Did that open up the door that was blocking the way to the exit? If I had to guess, that's what it did. Because otherwise, I would not have access to this very specific location. So let us go up here. And get out of here. Impossible mission. Very possible. Ah, what would I like on my tombstone? an easy way to get rid of this these guys yeah might as well use uh, the chain gun while I've got lower uh, shotgun ammo ah you jerk This is a waste of chain gun animation, actually. My 200% health, 200% armor. It was glorious. But it was so short-lived. I need to get rid of whatever is causing that. Probably a pain elemental on this side. Gets rid of you. Let's not pick up all this extra armor that I do not need, as that is wasteful. Uh, 
Ah. That's what I get for being trying to be fancy with my dodges. I need a blue key for that. I'll have to remember the placement of that blue key thing. All right, so there's a blue door. Another blue armor. You are hitting me, of course. Oh, is this the other side? Where are you guys coming from? It's like a little bit of everybody coming in from everywhere. Like, hey, I'm here, don't forget about me. I was actually hoping that second shot would have been enough. Alright, I've already cleared out that away. But I did not clear out this away. Which is fine. It's, it's now done. Okay, remember when I was saying that the levels were short? Clearly I spoke too soon. Because the last level was fairly long. And so is this one a little bit. Not that I'm complaining, I just want to, uh... Mention out of all of the times for me to say things, I've immediately presented the opposite. Yeah. Uh, sir, I do not appreciate you shooting rockets at me from a distance. This was a lot. Is that a... I need a yellow key for that one. So yellow key is top left, blue key is bottom center. Oh, I'm actually heading back towards where the... Uh, blue key was. Uh, where the bottom one was. So let's go back this way. Head around... that way, yeah. Oh, hello. Of course. I was gonna say, this room felt a little empty. Like, there was no way that there would be an empty room in this game. that get a review? Yes. And you, which means whatever's behind this door, which is probably just a big old cyber demon. Nope. Nope. Just, just regular demons this time.
All right. And the blue key. They were just standing around, minding their own business, uh, talking about work, spawn locations, what it's like being in the office as a demon today. And some jerk comes in and just grabs the grabs the blue key right from them. Um, let's see, there was uh, the switch down below. That, that required the blue key. Don't know exactly what that opened up. I'm sure it opened up something important. I feel as though that there will be so many Pachodemon corpses down this hallway that it'll be difficult to actually aim at them. Is that a red key door right at the end of this path? It is. Also interesting how I can't even see the rest of the level from past this hallway. It's a neat effect. All right, so I've made a few steps farther, but it looks as though, oh. I need to go this way. Sometimes, uh, again, damn it. I, I suppose even if it wasn't homing, it would have probably still hit me some. Hey, hello. Oh, hit that guy. That is the guy who we want to hit with our bullets until he dies. Everybody, stop getting in the way. I know you're all volunteering for immediate death, but really, please go in line in orderly fashion. That would be great. Um, hmm. Is it too early to grab this? Uh... Eh, yeah, nah. Might as well just grab it now. That way I don't have to think about it later. Oh my gosh, hello. Ah, what is this? Oh, this is just the uh, other way around for... Oh, that is a toxic floor. All right. this up. I did not realize a whole bunch of pinkies would just swarm in, so that's fine. Nope, nope. Oh my gosh. If there's anything that I... Is there an exit to this level that's not being blocked off by a whole bunch of bad guys at the moment? Oh my gosh. Even even switches that just appear out of nowhere are tripping me up. Like, my goal was to get to a better vantage point so I can clear out these revenants. Not to blow myself up shooting a switch rising out of the floor. Oh, no. And 
then there's you over there mining your own business. Thank you very much. Right, hello, new arrivals. Oh, hello. Ah, damn it. Again. I will always get myself caught on some piece of structure. It is my superpower. Okay, here's a question. How do I get back up? from here. I'm going to save here, instead of just... Oh, okay. I need health, not... Yep. Excellent. Okay, but now how do I get back? Alright, let's just... Let's just load this, and then... Quick save here. We'll deal with the consequences of such... We at least know there is a super health waiting around the corner. Uh, nope. So what I probably do is there is a switch somewhere that I have yet to discover. And then grabbing or dealing with that switch opens up that platform. Maybe. Or maybe not. Oh. See, that's what I was expecting way earlier there. Okay, there was a yellow door this way, and that's where everybody was making all the noise. Nope. <laughs> Not this time, Revenant. Ah, that time, yes. Then finally, that pain elemental is dealt with. Along with his 50 billion... Geez, lost souls that have been spawning this entire time. Oh, look, there's another one. Also, I think I heard a mancubus in there. That's fine. We'll deal with it as it comes. Oh no!
All right. See, that's what makes the chain gunners really dangerous, is they, um... Like, they just shoot regular bullets, and their individual hits may not be as damaging as that of a cacodemon. But their constant, like, stream of fire is generally enough. And that looks like it's going to be a trap. Everything was fine until I got caught on the architecture. Oh my gosh. That is a lot. Oh, and that just missed entirely. Do I even need to fight them? I mean, the answer is probably not. I mean, I guess now the answer is probably and then the art files are just going to replace the ones I destroyed. All right. How about this? I got an idea. Let's go with the plasma rifle. See if we can target. Never mind. Is this. This is non toxic. Good. Like, there's just so much going on with this. A little bit too much. Now, can I goad them more into fighting amongst themselves? That, that, is, that would be the trick, I think, to get this done. And also getting back into the hallway correctly. Okay, one's dead. I've saved. Finally. Wow. Who would have thought two giant bad guys surrounded by... A whole bunch of other bad guys would be so dangerous. But here I was. Where am I even? Like, literally. Oh, hello. Oh. And of course, there are invisible demons, along with this mancubus. Because why not bring a crowd? I do appreciate it that the mancubus's splash damage was enough to uh, just take down some random enemies as well. Ah, son of a... So that one is toxic. The other is not. Okay, so I need to go up. And to the right. I think. Where was the blue door that led to the... That was down and to the left, I think, actually. Uh, through there, yes. This looks like an exit. It is not. This looks like a trap. Mm. 
It is... It is nothing. Or I need to find a switch first. Okay. Was there a red switch that I missed? Like, I think there was a switch, um... Up. Nope, not that way. Is that a... Oh. There's a secret. All right. Um, there was a switch, I think, here? No. It was down here. I had already accessed that one. Okay. I'm gonna wander about, see what I missed. Oh, hold on. Another secret. Oh, hello. You know, actually, it doesn't matter how much damage this guy deals to me. All right, now I'm gonna wander around, see if I can find something. Oh yeah, there was that thing way up there. Did that actually amount to anything? It does, like, it looks important on the map. Uh, there's some health here. I don't need it. Huh. And that's where I get the red key. Oh, hello. Where did you guys come from? What switch did I push that manifested you into existence? All right, now let's try the exit again. Maybe I did something differently. Here we go. That's the button I missed. And now in theory, this will work. There we go. Wow. Well, I think... I think this is where I'm going to stop for the night. Got any suggestions for someone to play next? Leave them down in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have yourselves a good night.